Well, hello traders, I'm L.A. Little with TA Today, and I say let's make a trade and let's do it in two minutes or less. In the neoclassical model, there's only two types of trades. One type is a breakout, and that is, is where you go over some sort of a high and you just keep pushing higher. That's the breakout. The retrace is the other type of trade, and that is, is where you go over a swing point high, you move up, you come back, you test, and then you mush higher. In that case, you actually have more information. You come back, you can see what kind of test, what kind of volume you have as you test into the bars that were either breaking out of a swing point itself, and you get more information. The one exception where the breakout is the trade you should make, usually you're doing retraces, is the case where you get multiple swing point breakouts on multiple time frames. And there's an example of that taking place here in BABA today. Breaks out, gets over a swing point high, you can see the trend change, that's on the daily. If you move over, look at the weekly, you're getting the breakout over a swing point high as well. If that continues up on the week, you're going to have a breakout over multiple time frames, and usually when you get that, you get two to three bars. Extension in the direction of the break on the longest time frame that was broken. A good example of that recently was one that I alerted to about a week ago was, was Tesla. Tesla broke out, gets over swing point high on the daily time frame. And if you move over to weekly time frame, same thing, breaking out over a swing point high, two to three bars on the longest time frame. You can see bar one there, expect another bar. That's the kind of move you can expect. That's the exception to the rule. That's when a breakout has a higher probability of success than a retrace.